lovelies and welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, hi, my name is Gil Y, but you can also call me Mineker and you're watching episode 16 of the Eco Lifestyle Let's Play that we're doing here on this channel. And it's just Monday morning, I did play a little bit off camera. Basically I had Daniel try to do a little bit of fixing around the, ho around the home lot. He's still on it, I also did have him upgrade some of the appliances, so our fridge currently does have a green eco footprint. Also our uh, shower, kind of forgot the word, but our shower also has a green eco footprint and he also did start making summer candles. He finished making his five candles as well as collecting the insects from an insect farm. He's really close to reaching level 7 in fabrication, so in this episode we'll definitely get on to being... Going like with the fourth part of the Master Maker aspiration. Nia, she's already into work. She also is eating for two apparently. So in the last episode, her and Aiden did a little bit of a risky boohoo in the dumpster diving. And as you can see, she definitely is pregnant from him. So we're going to be getting a little baby in this series as well. I'm really excited. I'm Definitely really excited to see if they're going to get a boy or a girl. We just got a girl in our legacy challenge let's play that we're also doing here on the channel. So I'm really excited to see what the baby of Aiden and Nia are going to look like. Also you're going to clean uh. toilet. No, we're going to say clean. Uh. But yeah, Aiden is just going to... Aiden, Daniel is just going to keep on working on creating some candles. <sighs> He does need to make f uh, three uh, cylindrical uh. candles on a candle making station and then send them to the client. He already made one that I did off camera as well, so I'm just going to make sure that he makes the other two. And then we're keep on going, have him, him make some eco upgrade parts so that he can keep on upgrading everything with like an eco, a nice eco setting so that we once we have like the action plan, once that one finishes up then at least it's... Uh, almost there or completely finished up because we definitely need to make sure that everything is right and there is a bug in my game for some reason i was really close to getting a green eco footprint and now it's going to start all the way backwards like it's all like you can see on the screen it's almost back to neutral so this is a bug in the game we are supposed to have a green eco footprint to be honest so for me i'm going to say that one is achieved like even though we don't get the notification or even though we're not going to see it i know that it's supposed to be like a green eco footprint just because we have like so many things i also mm. did like a renovation off camera well not completely off camera i did it on camera but it's going to be a video that will be published next week thursday I did a little bit of a renovation of the caboose, which is like the bar that you can see over Aww. here. You can see a little bit of the result right now. I made it a little bit more greener. I added a lot of more eco-friendly products in there. It still doesn't have an eco-friendly footprint, but it does contribute a lot more to like the eco-friendly environment than it did before. So hopefully that will also help a little bit with like getting that back that eco footprint. But I don't know. There's just a glitch in my game and. If th this probably needs to be fixed with the upgrade part or with like another patch update because I've seen like online that more multiple people are suffering from this unfortunately due to it just being a glitch within the game but yeah we're going to keep doing our best we're going to make everything as green as possible just to please Nia as well as to just make sure that we at least have done everything that we can in our power to make everything green. Yay, we got to level 7, so that means that we're finally on the fourth step of the Master Maker aspiration. Easy. Meaning that we now have to reach level 10, make 20 candles and then complete 5 gigs as a freelancer. And voting is closed. Apparently it's Promote Creative Arts that's now taking effect. Well, even though we do want like even though that's really good for Daniel, that's probably not what we're supposed to get. So, Nia, <laughs> what you're going to do is you're going to... Well, you're going to submit your blueprint, actually. <sighs> and then what do you have to do? You have to gain influence. Well, we're going to lose a little bit of influence. Because in the next... When there's a voting, we're going to do a petition for repeal. And then vote for something else. And Dante, we're not coming over because we have way too much stuff to do. We're going to also read skillbook, uh, logic skillbook for level 5 because that one is necessary for the next promotion. 
trying to make sure that we're going to keep on track with the logic reading because that's definitely something that I think we need to reach level 10. And Daniel, you're going to keep making the candles and keep updating. I think this one now is also upgraded. No, it's not, but you can upgrade it. Like which, oh, you're going to upgrade it. Okay, good. Let's see, we're just going to make sure that everything will be completely upgraded. Then let's see, we're also going to make a candle. We need to make one more cylindrical candle. So let's make one more. And then also you need like, to make some more eco upgrade parts. Guys, we did it. Okay, so I was talking about that we actually had a glitch in the game, but mm. now it does say that it's green. So as I said, we're just going to say it's green. Like, look at it. I can't. Okay. Real quick, page up. Let's see. We're going to zoom all the way out because I want to take a picture of our little place with the beautiful Aurora skylights. Because that's definitely what we were going for in the series to just get like that entire green life. The, the beautiful lights, the beautiful green home. Let's see. We finally did it, guys. So we officially finally got the pop-up that we do have a green home. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a picture of the home with the, with the aurora lights. Just as proof that we are capable of reaching our goal. Well, Nia's at work. Daniel's just taking care of the... Yes, not the grubs, that. the beetles. I was going to say oh. the grubs, but... Our beetles. He's also just going around the home, making sure that he upgrades everything, trying to make sure that everything is clean, and just so that Nia doesn't have to do much besides working. So he can take like the time home to relax, make sure that she's feeling good, that there's nothing going with the baby, because that's like the most important part for her, especially as his as her best friend. Then I think that the most important part is to be there for her and try to make sure that she doesn't have to do much. She's the one who brings in most of the money. He's mostly staying at home, uh, doing what he loves. And that he's really grateful for her that he can do that. But then he does know that he needs to make sure that the house at least is looking good. So that when she comes home, she doesn't have to do the cleaning as well. So right now he's making a carved candle. This is the first time that he's going to be making a carved candle. So I'm really interested to see how it goes. And there is a glitch in my game, another glitch, but this one is actually positive. That whenever I st click on make a candle, it adds like a made candle to the list. And apparently Eric is just sending us some money. Okay. We're just going to say that he sent it to uh, to Daniel, but then Nia was the one who got it on the account. Because they have like a shared account or something for like the house. Maybe something like that, or that like... Daniel, he couldn't get a hold of Daniel, so he just texted Nia that he sent Daniel some money for the both of them. And then Nia, once you get out of work, you're going to harvest everything as usual. You're also going to need read a logic skill book level for level 5. Because I definitely think that you'll be getting a promotion today. And then these are bluebells, I think. So you're also going to harvest those together with the daisies. Because that's another source of income that is definitely very good for the little home. Especially if we're going to be moving, I think, now that our neighborhood... It says that it's neutral aga again, but it's definitely been green. Now that we've managed to get this neighborhood to green, we're going to be moving to a different one. There is already a green neighborhood, which is... If we go like looking around, it should be somewhere over there. Uh, sorry, she's at work, Dante. And then there's also like the neighborhood over there. And the neighborhood over there basically isn't green. It's the neighborhood where Aiden lives. So we can see if we can go to that neighborhood and make the neighborhood where Aiden lives green. Also, that would be easier for neighbor for Aiden to come over to see his little baby. So that could be an option. Or we can move to like the green neighborhood and actually see it. And yay, she got promoted. Oh, nice. That means that we're on level 5. We're promoting... We got level 5. Just 5 more to go. But yeah, I'm definitely happy that she got promoted. Because that means... Well, Nox, we're not coming over. She needs uh -huh. to make sure that she does her things. But now we can rally voters, which is nice. And she needs to make sure that she gains influence and reaches level 5 with the logic skill. 
So if we do that one and then work really hard tomorrow, maybe we can get to level 6. Ooh, that would be nice. You also need to do some harvesting here, so harvest everything here as well. And Daniel, you're still working on the candle. Oh. It looks like a regular candle to be honest, but maybe like once you do a little bit of working on it that you actually get it to be carved. He does look really serious when he's actually doing this as well. Like he's so focused, really into it. I think it's really cute, like whenever he makes a candle, he just really goes for it. And then you do have some eco upgrade parts, don't you? You have two of them. Well, can we use them for anything? Like can we use it to upgrade the laptop? Probably should keep a list of what we already upgraded. Well, he's too uncomfortable, so that means a no-go. And he's made a carved candle, so hopefully we can also start a new gig. Is this one already finished, the one that we had? Well, we finished everything, but it's just not finishing. Not sure what's up with that. And Daniel, probably you should go to the toilet before cleaning this one. Because we don't want you to pee your pants. And Nia, she's just multitasking over here. She's doing the gardening while reading logic. Trying to be very logical about making sure that it's... That it's all like nice and happy and good. Ooh, and apparently Dante decided to come over to see his sister. So why don't you quit harvesting everything? And just invite him in and also tell him the great news that you're actually pregnant. I definitely think that Big Bro would love to be the first one to know. So invite him in and then share the big news. And I do have a Should mod installed that actually Nicholas sees like Nicholas. more Nicholas. different reactions. They're completely randomized. So we'll just see what Dante's reaction is. I think he was happy for his sister. He might be like a little bit cautious. Like, okay, you're pregnant but you're not like together and ooh, we made some fizzy grape juice so why don't we just call it fizzy grape juice i think it should be fine and daniel he reached level two of the juicing i just made him also do a little bit of juicing and now he can try experimenting with herbs flowers and soybeans sounds very good and apparently our concept was great as well so we got some simoleons for that one and some career performance so if we can reach that level 5 of the larger scale, as I said, before our shift tomorrow, we definitely should be able to get another promotion. So I just got a notification saying Nia has cramps and pain, she should go to the hospital. This is from little Miss Sam, the Miss, uh, it's abortion and I'm not 100% sure, but it's like the mod that basically has... Gives you the possibility to maybe lose the baby, so hopefully there's nothing going on, but why don't we just have her go to the hospital, let's see where the option is. I think it should be somewhere over here. Yeah, go to the hospital and then take Aiden with you because he's like the father, just let him know like, hey, um, I did a pregnancy test, I wanted to tell you, but now I'm feeling cramps and pain and I just want you to come with me because... If there's something going wrong, I want you to know like what happened. So I don't want to scare you, but just come with me and see if there's something like going on or not. Miscarriage, that's the word that I was looking for. But yeah, we're going to see if she's having a miscarriage. Hopefully she doesn't. Hopefully she's fine. Like Daniel's definitely panicking. Dante is panicking. But let's just hope that she's actually okay. So unfortunately... She did lose the baby. She's now feeling very, very depressed from having a miscarriage. And she will be feeling depressed for 8 days. Also, due to the mod, there is a baby added to the family tree saying Danny Johnson. So her and Adam were supposed to actually get a son. But she had a miscarriage in her second trimester. So our girl, she'll be feeling very, very sad for a while. <sighs> Even... Even Daniel, he's feeling depressed for her. Like you can see as well that he's feeling very, very sad. So it's I'm guys, I'm really sad for the for them as well. Like she was so happy being pregnant. She was finally starting a, a family, uh, having something outside, trying to get like th the world a better place. She was trying to make like her life a little bit of a better place. And now she got a miscarriage, so she'll probably be like, this is something that she'll probably 
really struggle with also i'm not sure how this will influence her relationship with aiden because he he didn't really get to know like the the pregnancy life he just like got the call i'm pregnant but i'm having pain can you come to the hospital and then hears that he lost his baby not even knowing that he was going to be a father so i'm not sure how this will affect him as well but if you guys like this episode click that little like button down below comment if you're sad for them losing the baby also comment if you're actually excited that we did get to a green neighborhood and yeah what we're going to do in the next episode like i'm going to build like a different home for them also let me know in which neighborhood we should move to for the episode after the next episode so that i know where to build the home and yeah if you have subscribed already please do so as well help me and my channel grow and i'll see you guys on thursday for another video bye I saw her standing in the street alone, alone, alone. Her head was down, face locked onto the phone, phone. And I wished I